Hey there guys, Super Vegeta here, bringing you another video on Marvel Contest of Champions. In today's video, we're going to be opening 10 of the brand new 5 star featured crystal. So, let's go in and show you guys who's in the new featured. Right, we've got Apocalypse, Cosmic Ghost Rider, Red Goblin, Immortal Abomination, all of these, and Spider Ham. These are the big wins in here guys. Everything else is pretty mediocre and be a bit of pants if we ended up with those but I'm big time after Apocalypse, big time after Cosmic Ghost Rider so if we can hit those two I shall be really happy and won't need to waste my 6 star shards on a featured crystal alright guys uh, once again I'd just like to thank everybody for your support in all my previous videos and if you're not already subscribed please hit that subscribe button as this really helps me out hit the like button, leave a comment down below now without further ado, let's get on with the opening. I'm just going to fast tap all of these open. Apart from the last one, I'm going to leave to just roll out and open naturally. Right, first crystal is an Infinity War Iron Man. If this was a couple of years ago, this guy would have been amazing on war defense. But everybody's got used to fighting him now, so he's a bit redundant now. Right, let's move on to the second one. Oh yes, we get Immortal Abomination. He's one of the ones we were searching for, so that's not bad. A featured champion on the second crystal, so the luck is with us at the moment. Let's hope it continues. Next crystal, come on. Oh, Immortal Hulk. I don't know how to feel about this, guys. He ain't the best character in the world, but he is one of the featured characters, so... I don't know. Maybe have a play around with him. If not, he's always arena fodder. Alright, come on. Where's that Apocalypse? Where's that Cosmic Ghost Rider? There goes Cosmic Ghost Rider. spider Ham. No. Oh, yes. We awakened Immortal Abomination. That's, that saved me an awakening gem, guys. Yeah, may have to rank him up and have a play with him. He's good in certain circumstances where you can hit loads of poisons onto people. Right, crystal number five. Oh, Ghost Rider. One off a of Cosmic Ghost Rider. However, this does awaken my Ghost Rider for the first time, so he's got that extra judgment now, which makes him a little bit better. Right, let's get rid of these offers out of the way. Right, halfway through. Still no sign of Apocalypse and Cosmic Ghost Rider yet, but we've still got plenty of crystals to go. And a yellow jacket. As you can see by him being a new character, I've managed to dodge him up until now. But hopefully his rework's going to make him a new god tier character. So if not, we just won't bother ranking him up. Right, on onwards and upwards. And we get a Doc Ock. It's hard to be mad at that. I've really fancied playing around with a Doc Ock. I don't have him any higher than a four star. So it'd be nice to take on some end game content with him. Right, starting to get a little worried now. We only have three crystals left and we haven't hit Apocalypse and we haven't hit Cosmic Ghost Rider. Ugh, Crossbones. I really like the Crossbones character in Marvel. However, the character in this game, he's not the best in the world. So, right, two left. One should be Cosmic Ghost Rider and one will be Apocalypse in an ideal world. Alright, come on. There goes Apocalypse. Come back round. Oh, no. Not another Infinity Man. Well, this takes him up to Sig 40. Let's move on. Last Crystal. I'm just going to leave it to spin out, guys. So, once again, I'd just like to thank everybody for your amazing support. We are closing in on the 200 subs mark, which for me is fantastic. When I started this channel, I had no idea I'd get anywhere near that. I thought I'd just have a few subs from friends at work and family, and that'd be that. 
but you guys have shown me so much support over the last couple of months so thank you now if we don't get an apocalypse out of this crystal i have enough six star shards that i can get two featureds and one basic so depending on how the featureds go if we get apocalypse out of one of those we will open the basic at the end or i'll just save up shards and open another featured so right let's see what this is going to end on Ugh, a Gamora. That is not what we were looking for, guys. The first half was so full of promise. We had four featureds out of five, and then just five basics afterwards. That is rubbish. But never mind. There's always more shards to collect and more crystals to open. So thank you all for watching, and I will see you all in the next one.